Hello there. My name is Fox, and welcome back to another Nerd News. Today, we are going to talk about the Nintendo Direct that happened last week. There were some really fantastic bombshells that dropped in that Nintendo Direct. We're basically going to only talk about one thing today, and that's the Mario Brothers casting that the in entire internet is freaking out over. Which I'm kind of surprised, because Nintendo dropped a lot of really cool new stuff uh, <laughs> in that Nintendo Direct. That new... Um, like a Chocobo racing game I'm super excited about, Bayonetta 3, Splatoon 3, uh, the new 3D open world Kirby game. All that stuff looks so fantastic, and we'd probably be talking about that if we weren't going to talk about Chris Pratt as Mario. Now, I know the entire internet is hating on Chris Pratt right now, hardcore, because he's been casted as Mario. Uh, personally, for me, I like Chris Pratt as an actor. Like, I like the stuff he's done and everything else. I, I think he's a good actor, and I think, I think he's going to be pretty decent in most of the roles he's in. With Mario, I'm very much on the fence about it. Because I grew up on Charles, Charles Martinet's voice acting of Mario um, forever since I was a kid. Because Mario 64 came out when I was, like, 13 or 14. When Nintendo 64 came out, if I remember. It sounds kind of about right. Roughly somewhere in there. That was the first time we got to hear Mario speak in a game. It's a me, it's a Mario. I'm a tired. Oh no. Why? It was great. It was great. It was Mario. That to me, that is Mario. Uh, I know a lot of people are complaining about, oh, he's not Italian, you shouldn't be voicing, blah blah blah. So let's discuss that for a minute. Of Chris Pratt not being Italian, and why people are mad about that, and why they shouldn't be mad about that. Because number one. The, the guy that currently does Mario voices all in all the video games, Charles Martinet. Uh, and I, I, I've tried to do my research on this to make sure I get these f facts, uh, the facts that I'm going to spit out at you correct. If I did not, uh, feel, please feel free to correct me in the comments below. Uh, I did my best. And hopefully I don't get anything wrong. And I'll try to correct things if I do get them wrong. But, um, Charles Martinet, who's been doing Mario's voice since... Um, there was a typing game, I think, that came out, and then the big one was Mario 64. Uh, the dude's French. I'm pretty sure he's French descent. Martinet is, is, is a French French name. Uh, he, he speaks fluent French, he speaks fluent Spanish, he speaks a little bit of Italian, um, and English, of course. Uh, phenomenal voice actor. If you're not about him, if you're not mad about him not being Italian and voicing an Italian, American Italian Japanese character. Um, then I feel like your stuff's null and void, a little bit, in my opinion. Um, looking back on all of the people who have done Mario's voice, from, or who's played Mario in some aspect, uh, as far as I can tell, there's only been one actual Italian actor that has played Mario, um, and that was Lou Albano, who played Mario in the live-action scenes and did the voice uh, for the animated section of the Super Mario Brothers Super Show uh, back in the early 80s. I think it came out in 80, or I guess late 80s, 88. Then after him, so he, he was the first one to play Mario. Phenomenal actor. I loved him. I absolutely loved the Super Mario Brothers Super Show. I still quote that show today. It was a fantastic show. Still holds up to this day. If you go back and rewatch it, it's fun to watch. Awesome show. Lou Albano was fantastic. Um, Forgetting off the top of my head the guy that played Luigi in that show, but he was also a fantastic actor too. I loved it. Um, then later on, I believe 90, 1990, the second animated Mario cartoon came out. Um, it was the Adventures of Super Mario Brothers 3, and then a year after that, in 91, uh, Super Mario World came out. And that cartoon was voiced by Walker Boone, who is an American actor. He was also not Italian. And then you move on to the live-action uh, Super Mario Brothers movie, which I know uh, it's a B movie, basically. P people love it because it's so terrible. Uh, but Bob Hoskins and John Leguizamo, also not Italian, and they played Mario and Luigi in a live-action aspect where they were on screen. Because uh, I believe Bob Hoskins is uh, an English actor, and then uh, John Leguizamo is a Hispanic actor. So neither of them are Italian. And I mean, obviously, you can't go back and be like, "Oh, we gotta cancel them because they played non-Italian. They were non-Italian, played 
Italian characters, blah, blah, blah. Like, well, like, Bob Hoskins, Lou Albano, and uh, Walker Boone are all, have all passed away. If you want to gripe about them, that's fine. You can't. That's done. It's in the past. Whatever. John Leguizamo is still alive. And he's still doing great stuff. I personally loved the portrayal of them in the live action movie, and I thought it was great. I thought it was fantastic. Now, moving on to Chris Pratt. I know he's not Italian, but neither is the other current Mario voice actor. So I, I feel... I don't know. That's that's my personal opinion. I feel like you can't complain about that unless you complain and bitch about uh, Charles Martinet voicing an Italian character who's he's not of Italian descent. That's my personal opinion. He's been the voice of Mario for the last, like, 25 plus years. Um... And, and I, I feel like if you're going to go after Chris Pratt for not being Italian, like, oh, you can't voice this character because you're not Italian. Blah, 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 blah. Italian people are so sad. People not voice this. Like, would, would you guys be doing the same thing if Charles Martinet had gotten the role? Would you be doing that because he's not Italian? I don't think you would. I, I feel like in this particular case, I wouldn't say this for all roles throughout Hollywood or anything else. I'd say in this particular case... Like you should let the Italian thing go. Because the guy who has been your fan favorite, if you're a real Mario fan, Charles Martinet has been doing the voice for the last 25 plus years. You haven't complained about him voicing Italian, Italian-American Japanese man. Okay? He's fine. Now, with that being said, and we've also said that I love, I like Chris Pratt. I think he's a great actor. Um, I think the people complaining that Hollywood is replacing really good voice actors out there with A-list celebrities, I do feel like that's a problem. Uh, I know a buddy of mine was saying that Charles Martinet like, kind of gave the green light to Chris Pratt playing Mario. I tried to search on some of his social media. I didn't see that anywhere. Um, even if he did say that, it could be like, oh, you know, he's just saving face because, you know, he wants he wants the thing to succeed. Now, Charlie Day as Luigi, I think, is going to be absolutely phenomenal. So Charlie Day is a very much kind of typecasted for himself. Like, if you've ever seen Always Sunny in Philadelphia, he's basically that type of character. When he's in the second Pacific Rim movie, he was very much the same exact character, except, you know, obviously a lot smarter and a lot more uh, involved with the scientific facts and different things like that. But he was still, like, the same just crazy, kooky, off-the-wall, like, bouncing everywhere, like, hyperactive type of character. Um, <laughs> I think that's perfect for Luke. I think it's going to be great. Right, so after Luigi, we have Anna Taylor Joy, who's playing the next main character in the series or in the in the movie. Uh, she's going to be playing Princess Peach. I am very unfamiliar with this actress. She uh, she's done a bunch of things. She's been a lot of good stuff. Just a lot of stuff that I haven't seen, so I can't really voice an opinion on her. She looks like she'd be able to do a fantastic role with voice. Uh, but yeah, I just don't know. I don't know enough about her. I really have an opinion on whether she's going to be great for the role or not. Um, let's wait and see on that one. And then, of course, man, Jack Black as Bowser. This is going to be fantastic. So fantastic. I, I hope they utilize maybe some of his uh, singing and stuff uh, as Bowser. I don't want it to be a musical or anything by any stretch of the imagination. But uh, I, in my head, especially with some of the games and different things, I've always associated Bowser with like heavy metal rock music and, and different things like that. And I think Jack Black is a fantastic, very animated type of character that's going to be perfect as Bowser. Uh, so we also have Keegan Michael, uh, Keegan Michael Key as Toad. I'm really curious. Like I love him too. I think he's a fantastic actor, but I'm curious how he is going to end up playing the role itself. I'm guessing we're probably not going to get uh, traditional character voices uh, from the games and stuff when we hear the, when we see this movie. Um, but I'm glad he's in it too because I, I love his work really great one. That's going to do it for this Mario video. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching and uh, hanging out with me and watching my videos. I really appreciate that. I apologize that I have not been posting uh, in a very long time. Sometimes it's very hard to get the energy to to create things. But it's fun spending a lot of my energy on cleaning and looking for a job. Uh, so it's been a lot of work. But I appreciate you guys so much. I appreciate you guys staying sub to my channel. I appreciate anybody new that's subbing to the channel. You guys are fantastic. Love every one of you. Uh, with that being said, 
please let me know down in the comments below what you thought of the video what you thought what do you think of the casting that's coming out for the new mario brothers movie are you gonna go see it are you excited about it do you hate chris pratt with a passion let me know anything anything you want to talk about let me know in the comments down below i will do my best to reply as soon as possible until next time, guys, please be kind to each other, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Logical high five.